Hi everyone, today we're gonna to be practicing dribbling and kicking in soccer. The only thing that you're gonna need because we're at home today is a blank piece of paper. Crumple it up and we're gonna make it into our ball today. If you don't have a blank piece of paper, that's okay. Just go ahead and take a pair of old socks, roll them up and you can use that as your ball instead. So in soccer, we need to remember that we're only going to be using our feet today. We're not gonna be using our hands when we're practicing our skills. The first skill that I want us to practice is the dribble. And unlike basketball, where we're dribbling with our hands, in soccer, we're gonna be dribbling with our feet. So I want you to practice dribbling back and forth, using your feet and having the ball go back and forth between our feet. Dribbling, we want control. We wanna control the ball. We shouldn't ever have to run after the ball. So dribbling around a room and keeping that ball close to you and keeping it going back and forth between your feet as you are moving. That's dribbling. The other thing I want you to practice today is your kicking. And when we're practicing kicking, the thing I want you to remember is that we're gonna actually be using the inside of our feet today, not our toes. We're gonna use the inside of both of our feet. I know that there's probably a foot that you enjoy using more than the other, but we need to make sure that we know how to kick with both of our feet, not just one of our feet. So today with your ball, I want you to put your ball on the ground. And remember when we are doing kicking, you're going to step with the opposite foot and then you're gonna proceed with your kick. And I want you to kick with the inside of your foot. So it's gonna be a step and kick. All right, a step and kick. And then make sure that you're not just practicing it on the one side, that you're also practicing it on the other side. So you're doing a step and kick on that side as well. So I want you to make sure that you're practicing your dribbling, going back and forth, keeping that ball between your feet while you are moving around. Then I want you to make sure that you're practicing your step and kick and your step and kick using the inside of our foot today, not our toes. So dribble, control, back and forth, kick, step and kick with the inside of our feet using both legs, not just one. And I, if you get most comfortable with both dribbling and the kicking, you can add them together and do dribble, 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 kick. You can do dribble, dribble, kick. You can practice it a lot of different ways, but just make sure that you are comfortable and you've got that control with your dribble and you have that control with your kick. You're also making sure using those inside of your feet. So today I want you to practice your dribble and your kick and then see if you can add your dribbles with your kick today. Have fun.